Alright, hello everyone. Today we'll be doing the avant-garde car review. Now today we'll be checking out him. We'll be talking about the colors a little bit. We're gonna be doing the pushing part we're gonna talk about and then um, some, and um, that should be it for this video. But for now, let's go ahead and check out the colors. We have this avant-garde in blue and some red and white. They're like Panama, Panama, a, a flag. Looks a bit like the United States car or France with this car, but it's like the World Soccer. It was from 2014, I had it for like a long time, since like um, six years ago. And then we got this one, avant-garde, in the yellow, and the yellow seats, and we have this light blue line. Uh, I'm not sure which one I really like, to be honest, but um, I'm gonna say like all of them I really like. I don't have a dislike in this one. Because um, I like this side with some yellow seats on it, I, I'll give them credit. And like with the red seats on this one, because blue and red matches together, so it's white, red, white, and blue. My favorite colors right there, except I don't just usually like a lot of white. But um, I really like with this side, this, this design they made, I really don't like a lot of white. Like, um, let me grab a card with my grabber. Here, this one, this Honda Civic, the 2018 Honda Civic Type R. I already done a review on it. That's what I'm talking about. I just don't like it in all white, like this one. But um, this one it looks pretty cool, which I will I'll give them credit. Now this one I really like it as much. Just take the Honda Civic. I really like this one better. And um, I have a this one has a light blue. I like this one with the red base. This one's all blue base. Which I don't know what's my favorite a lot, but I'm gonna say like th these two are my favorite ones so far. This is a hard de decision, but um, yeah, I'm gonna stick with these two because these two are my favorite cars that I have. This one I had like five or six years ago. Six years ago? Five to six years ago. But um, let's go ahead and do the pushing part. I really can't wait for this, these cars. Let's see how well they do. Let me move this. Ready, go. Ooh, the bumper's a little bit moody. The bumper's not too straight. Like the Fords. See, look. If you go to the left rear. Oh, wait. The, when you push it right here, it's going to move a little bit. I think. Because when it goes right here. This part right here moves out of the way a little bit. But let's go ahead and the left rear. And yeah, the bumpers are a little bit moody, but this bumper it's not really straight like a like a Chevrolet like a Roadster or a, I don't know, a car test I don't remember, I remember but um I know that Ford the bumpers are straight Chevrolet are definitely not straight and so does Toyota I believe they're straight as well Honda Nissan and Subaru and I don't know about those but um yeah look at this nose right here look at this let me zoom in let me zoom in hold up Look at the nose right here. It's like too. It looks a bit too straight. There's a UPS going by in my carpet, so fantastic. So I like this side with red or FedEx, whatever truck that was, or gray on this side. I like this side, and um, yeah, the bumper's a little bit not straight, like I say, but um, at least it was a little bit of push and it was a good save. But anyways, hope you all enjoy this video for a long car. Look forward for that video. Hope y'all have a great day or a night and bye for now.